Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I am so excited. We're gonna be watching Ocean's Eleven from 2001. And I know this is a heist movie. I love heists. So let's get heisting. Here we go. Ocean's Eleven. Okay, okay, okay. Heist, 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 heist. Okay, girl. I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Just saw Clooney in Gravity, so if you missed that, make sure you check it out. Just saw Matt Damon in Born, make sure you check out that trilogy. We got Clooney! Good morning. So handsome. Daniel Ocean. He's Ocean, got it. You are likely to break the law again. You have been implicated in over a dozen other confidence schemes and frauds. I was never charged. Was there a reason my wife left me? Got into a self-destructive pattern. <laughs> Is it likely you'd fall back? What's he gonna say? She already left me once. I don't think she'd do it again. It's not really an answer. What do you think you would do if released? Oh. Hi, <laughs> hat. They released him? I feel like you can't trust anything that a con man says. However, a handsome Clooney is very convincing. So, I'm gonna chuck it. This is good heisting music already. I like it. Ocean's Eleven. All right, so he's a con man, just got out of jail. And I believe there's a heist in it, so I feel like he's gonna pull a heist. Right to the casino. Hello, Frank. No, it's you must have me confused. My name is Ramon. Uh-huh. It's my mistake. Okay, Ramon. Table's cold anyway. Try the lounge at the Caesars. One o'clock? Yes, sir. That's a secret meeting if I ever saw one. You seen him? Last I heard he was teaching movie stars how to play cards. You have a plan already? I just became a citizen. Oh, he's yeah. got a plan. I told to contact you within 24 hours. I wouldn't even think about leaving the state. <laughs> Tattooed Red Pit. So cute. I could totally make it a tax write-off. What's that dude from that 70s show? But I'd have to pay you by check. The handlebar? Let's, or we could just take the cash. <laughs> begin with five card draw. Oh, hey, it's, uh, to your left. Joshua Jackson. I know him from Dawson's Creek. Lady Bits. I know all these guys. Oh, okay. What the hell, it's only pocket change, right? <laughs> you want to make them think you're betting for a reason. All right, right. All right, how many? That'd be cool. It's teaching them how to play. Let's see. You don't want four. You want to fold. No, okay. <laughs> even and, I know uh, that. You're done. <laughs> Either. You can't have six cards in a five oh, card me. game. Oh. Okay. Red. Oh, <laughs> it's literally nothing. <laughs> Jeez. He's had a long, hard day teaching idiots to play poker. Well, and not not teaching them. Rush, you know, over from television to film. Rush, uh, we got another player. Uh oh. They got beef? History, at least. I just got out of prison. Really? I stole things. Jewels. You can matrimonial head masks. Any money in those? <laughs> Boatloads. If you can move them. My fence seemed confident enough. That's $500. Are these guys friends? Kind of? It's first lesson in poker. Leave emotion at the door. That's right, Tofu. He's playing saying, himself. Saying nothing better than a pair of face cards. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> I will see your 500. They're all playing themselves. That's funny. That's a very handsome bet, Josh. I'm gonna keep them on the leash. Call. Raise it 2000. Oh! Guys, you're free to do what you like, but I'm staying in. He's trying to buy his way out of his bluff. I don't know who's right here. This is interesting. Clooney seems very smart and powerful, but Brad Pitt is calling him on this. Let's see him. Let's see him. The ace, I think, is pretty high. Thanks for the tip on calling out the bluff. Clooney. Oh, this is too funny, like Topher Grace getting asked for an autograph, but these two guys just walking by. Fiction, indeed. So how was the clink? Did you get the cookies I sent? Why do you think I came to see you first? I need planning. A large yes, crew. Yes. What's the target? Eight figures each. What's the target? What is the target? When was the last time you were in Vegas? You want to knock over a casino. Oh, three? <laughs> awesome. The vault at the Bellagio. <laughs> Oof. I'm so excited. Probably the least accessible vault ever yeah, designed. Yeah, 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 yeah. So three casinos. He's feeding the cages at the Mirage. And there were diamonds up there. Oh, it's all to one vault? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. The impenetrable vault. These are Terry Benedict's places. Wow. You think you'll mind? You'd need at least a dozen guys doing a combination of cons. Both a dozen guys? Jim Brown, a Miss Daisy, two Jethro's, and not to mention the biggest Ella Fitzgerald. It's the biggest Ella Fitzgerald. I'm like giddy. Oscar. Sorry. You guys done it? I'm just gonna take these home for the night and make some copies. Clooney is so slick. What? Why do this? Because yesterday I walked out of the joint and you're cold decking Teen Beat cover boy. I totally read Teen Beat. 
with Joshua Jackson. Because a house always wins. Unless when that perfect hand comes and you take the house. I've been practicing this. Did I rush it? Felt like I rushed it. <laughs> no, it's good. I liked it. I wonder what Ruben will say. Oh, Lord, they're handsome. Woo! You're both of you nuts. It cannot be beaten. They got the jewels, they coat, got the glasses. It's never been tried. It's been tried. The three most successful robberies in the history of Vegas. Pencil neck grabs a lockbox at the horseshoe. Wow. The flamingo in 71. <laughs> he was breathing out of a hose for the next three weeks. And the closest was Tell outside me. of Caesars. They conquered. They shot him. Uh, oh, this is going to be tough. I'm sure you can make it out of the casino. Of course. You're still in the middle of the desert. He's right. Ruben, you're right. Yeah, They're yeah, still yeah. going to do it. Blah. I owe you from the thing with the guy in the place. The thing with the guy in the place. That was our pleasure. I've never been to Belize. <laughs> Just out of curiosity, which casino? Bellagio, the Mirage, and the MGM Grand. Those are Terry Benedict. Benedict. That's a good bad guy name. What do you got against Terry Benedict? He torpedoed my casino. Mm. Now he's going to blow it up. Don't think I don't see what you're doing. I like that sneaky base. With Benedict, he better not know because he'll kill you. Mm. And then he'll go to work on you. And then he'll go to work on you. Well funded. Gotta be nuts, too. You're going to need a crew as nuts as you are. Yeah, 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 yeah. Crew montage. Banksy has developed a bad case of bronchitis transferred to warmer climates. <laughs> the Mormon twins? Mm. Oh, that's cool. Oh, it's uh, Casey Affleck. Waiting, sweetheart. Just waiting. You want? Go, little girl. I'm gonna, get in the car and I'm gonna drop you like third period French. They're racing. <laughs> I like these brothers already. They're goofy. <laughs> This is so cool. I'm having such a good time. Electronics? Livingston's been doing freelance surveillance work. How are his nerves? Okay. Good on this one. Zoom in. Hands. Do you see me grabbing the gun out of your holster? Relax. <laughs> oh, God. Basher's in town. There might be an issue with availability. Ooh, ooh, ooh we're blowing something here. Blowing the vault. Oh, I love him. Oh, dang it. Oh, leave it out. You had one job to do. Anyone. Are you accusing me of booby trapping? Fashion. Are they gonna take him? Simple G4 mainliner. Let me ask you something else. Did you search this scumbag? Stand back. Go find Greg's. Tell him I need to see him. Who? Oh? Just find him, will ya? Hey, man. I best you put something together for what I just slipped you. It's done. Oh my god, they're slick. It'll be nice working with proper villains again. Proper villains. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be real good. I like this crew already. And what do we have here? Which one's the amazing Yen? The little Chinese guy. <sighs> I don't know, it doesn't seem all that different. Oh. We got a grease man. What the grease man? We need Saul. Oh. Got out of the game a year ago. I love when there's a guy named Saul in it. You could ask him. Hey, I could ask him. This is so good. Oh my god, he's like an old guy. I love it! He's the perfect Saul. Okay. I saw you. I saw you before you even got up this morning. What's with the orange? My doctor says I need vitamins. What do they need him Lock for? Come on. <laughs> Saul, you're the best there is. What do you want? Nothing. I'm seeing a nice lady who works the unmentionable discount. <laughs> I've changed. Once a heister, always a heister, I think. Guys like us don't change, Saul. Yeah. Quit conning me. So are you going to treat me like a grown-up and tell me what the scam tell is? Tell him the job. This is going to be so good. I wonder what Saul's for. Saul makes 10. You think we need one more? Yes, 11. Let's make 11. All right, we'll get one more. This is a killer, jazzy score. I like it. Oh, right, Matt Damon. Literally, I forgot it. He's a thief. He's good. No one would suspect him. He looks like just a little nerd. Glasses. We'll do that. If I ever heist, I'm for sure wearing my glasses. Uh -uh. That's so cool. Fanny Ocean is a smooth mother ever. Hello, Linus. Who are you? A friend of Bobby Caldwell's. You're either in or you're out. Right now. In. In, in, in. It's a plane ticket job offer. Bobby has a lot of faith in you. Fathers are like that. Oh, he didn't tell you. Don't want me trading on his name. He'll be trading on yours. Oh, he's gonna do it. 
<laughs> Las Vegas, huh? I have no idea how people do things like that. Like magicians, I'm just like, how'd you do that? I could never figure it out. I'm completely naive and dazzled. Action. A little more bad, a little less bad. Are you about to have like a, like a, a lair? What, did yes. you guys get a group rate or something? Oh, wow. Thank you, Dick Provo. Gentlemen, welcome to Las Vegas. Look at this little party with finger sandwiches. I'm about to propose highly lucrative and highly dangerous. Help yourself to as much food as you like and have a safe journey. Otherwise, come with me. Oh my God, I would go 100%. Going with Clooney. I want to hear the plan. I want to hear the plan. I want to hear the plan. The Bellagio, the Mirage, and the MGM Grand. Most profitable casinos in Las Vegas. This is the vault at the Bellagio. It safeguards every dime that passes through the Bubbit. This place houses a security system that rivals most nuclear missile silos. These doors, each of which requires a different six-digit code. The elevator won't move without authorized fingerprint. The elevator shaft is rigged with motion detectors. Once we get down the shaft, though, then it's a piece of cake. Sounds impossible. The most elaborate vault door ever conceived. Oh my god, I have shivers. I want to heist this. On a fight night, the night that we're going to rob it, 150 million for 11 of us, each with an equal share. <whistles> exactly. I could whistle. We're just supposed to walk out of there without getting stopped? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. First task, reconnaissance. Okay. I want to know everything about every guard. I want to know where they're from. The dancer at the Crazy Horse is putting away through medical school. Crazy Horse. I want uh -huh. you guys to know the quick route. Went through at 1044. 46, get to watch that works. These dudes are just gonna bake her the whole movie, aren't they? I love it. We're gonna throw the switch on Sin City. Basher, it's your show. Right, it's done. Surveillance. Holy it's not crap. the least accessible system I've seen, but it's close. They employ an in-house technician? One of them's lonely. <laughs> Tired of your mom for me. She'll be on stage in five minutes. Charmaine and her mom. Okay. Not gonna lie though, in the back of my mind, I'm thinking all it takes is one of these guys to betray the other guys, and then it all goes to hell. Watch it, bud. Jackass. Oh, oh nice. Jackass. Thirty-three. We have a visual impairment. <laughs> but I don't think the screw's gonna betray each other. I don't want them to. Hand map. Stepping into the system. You are in my face. The most intimate. He's a balloon boy. Spinning boy by a face. Got it. I don't think there's been a moment without this music. I love it. And we're up and running. Why do they always paint hallways that color? Taupe is very soothing. <laughs> also, this movie is really funny. I have a very important Please, client waiting for these. <gasps> he sweat off his map. I don't think that's right. Did he leave something? Hey, hold up a minute. Uh oh, they can't get caught right out of the gate. Hey, drop this. Take care. Dude. Well. Got to get someone smooth like Clooney in there. Fourth task, we need to build an exact working replica of the Bellagio. Fifth yes, task intelligence. let's do that. We need those codes. A model, we're building models. Oh, good lord. So Benedict, learn to love his shadow. All I get to do is watch the guy. Sixth task, transport. <laughs> 18 five apiece. Thank you for your time, Mr. Uh, Billy Tim Denham. Denham like a jean. Denham like a jean. Man, you got some lovely hands. I tried all sorts of brand of lotion. Now my <laughs> sister, she uses a uh, aloe vera. Ideally, is speaking, he squeezing him? Should wear gloves. Be a little interference in my social agenda. <laughs> if you were willing to pay cash, yeah, say seven, sixteen. Uh, they told me to come see you. Okay, well, uh, I'll Ooh. be right back. You just wait here at the table. So, are you sure you're ready to do this? If you ever ask me that, you will not wake up the following morning. Ooh. Okay, so we hear you. He must be important. Lyman. My name is uh. Lyman Zerga. Lyman Zerga. He's got the brothers as his henchmen. Lyman Zerga. Rich foreign man. Okay, tell me about Benedict. He arrives at the Bellagio and remembers every valet's name on the way in. He works hard, hits the lobby floor at 7. Benedict likes to know what's going on. He spends a few minutes glad handing the high rollers. He's fluent in Spanish, German, and Italian, and he's taking Japanese. He's out by 7.30, contents, the day's take, and new security codes. 
This guy's all business. That portfolio contains the codes. In two minutes after they've been changed, he's got them in his hand. Oh, we need that portfolio. We need a switcheroo. This guy is as smart as he is ruthless. He doesn't mm -hmm. just take out your knee. Mm -hmm. You scared? You suicidal? Only in the morning. <laughs> now comes the girl. It's Julia. Oh. Awesome. Still don't know if we can use her yet. Her name is Tess. He knows her. Oh, he looks pissed. Bad sex. Tess, give me sex. Tell me this is not about her. I am walking off this job right now. Yes. Tell me this is not about screwing the guy who's screwing your wife. Ex-wife. Not entirely Dude. about that. Well, I lost something. That's why I'm here. You can't use your friends like that, man, or your partners like that without telling them the truth. Now we're stealing two things. If you can't have both, what you gonna choose? Yeah, I don't like this. I won't be the one that has to make that choice. How'd she look? She look good. She's so beautiful. I do want to see a Clooney Julia kiss, though. You like it? Yeah. In my hotels, there's always somebody watching. So Clooney wants her back. I wouldn't get into Terry Benedict. He doesn't fool around. Mr. Zerga wants to speak to you privately. Businessman of some kind. How's he doing? Up. Oh. Good for him. I knew there was going to be a complication. They were too slick, too smooth. All right, Julia. It's Clooney. Oh, it's Danny Osh. What are you doing here? Don't sit. Ooh. She does not want to see him. Handsome or not. You're not wearing your ring. I sold it. Didn't you get the papers? My last day inside. Go now before... What? Tess, yeah. you're doing a great job curating the museum. Although his work definitely fell off as he got older. Remind you of anyone? Artburn. She has no time for him. All right, I'll make this quick. I came here for you. When I get on with my life, I want you with me. I only She's lied about being a thief. I don't do that. Steal. Lie. You know what your problem is? I only have one. I'm with Terry now. Does he make you laugh? He doesn't make me cry. Oh, Mia. Yeah. I have a package arriving here, a black briefcase. The contents is very valuable to me. I'll put it in the house safe for you. <gasps> he wants it in the vault. I need something more secure. Yes, 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 Not go overlooked. What can you offer me? Vault, vault, vault. That's how they get in. You don't love me anymore. I'm gonna have to live with that, but not him. Dude, you can't say that. Do you remember what I said to you when we first met? That I better know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Does he? I'm worried Do you now. My ex-husband. Danny Ocean. I guess required my attention. That's fine. To get into the you vault. Recently, were released from prison. Is that correct? Danny was just about. I just to... stopped by to say I stay and have a drink. He you can't. Can. Oh, they do have chemistry. I don't though. imagine we'll be seeing Mr. Ocean anytime soon. I know everything that's happening in my hotels. So I should put those towels back. Terry. Danny. Benedict Ocean. Now it's quite tense between those two. Wait, Maddie D, what do you love to? I love Maddie D. Stylish. He's following Clooney. Look at this. <laughs> Shoo! 7.30. Yen gets locked in. We have 30 minutes to blow the power before he suffocates. Suffocate. We'll automatically shut down for two minutes. Oh, boy. It puts you in the middle of the room. It's the exact replica. Without touching the floor. 10 says he shorts it. 20. My money's on him. We're in deep sh Ew. They've only nosed up the mainframe couplet. You understand any of this? <laughs> Gone and blown the backup grid one by one. Problem is now they know their weakness. They're fixing it. We're in Barney. It's using so much slang. Barney rubble. Trouble! We could always <laughs> tomorrow. We could use a pinch. Pinch is a pinch. bomb. Without a bomb. Shuts down any power source within its blast radius. How long? About 30 seconds. There's only one pinch in the whale big enough to manage it. Where? Let's go. Come on. Going on a little side heist. Oh, no, 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 no. Really don't want Maddie D in on anything. I feel like he's gonna get pissed and go rogue. Go ahead, I got one. Are you gonna think of one? No, I'm done thinking about it. I Fine. have it in my head. Are you a man? Yes. Evil can evil. <laughs> Take your hand out like this. I'm, my hand's not in your hand. Oh my god, if I was him, I would just leave. This, this is your side. Just this is your side. Just get out, man. Yeah, feel that. <gasps> uh oh, they're coming right out. Get the all cut. Quit, quit. Where's Linus? 
What's he doing in there? Uh-oh. Back it up. Oh my god, not smooth. Like, at all. Well, jump. Go, 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 go. I feel like they're not working well together. <laughs> and that's our guy that needs to be agile. Maddie D, not cool. Where the hell are they? That was not a good first step. Boys have a nice trip? Not really. We have a problem. You've been red flagged. They'll be watching you. Oh, that can't be a surprise. Any idea how this happened? He's been chasing Benedict's girl. Oh, the truth. And who told you to do that? I was concerned you couldn't leave Tess alone. You're out, Danny. His involvement puts us He's all out. When you put her before us. Yeah, that's kind of fair. Who's going to trigger the vault? Kid, you up for it? Oh, I don't know. I can do it. Tess is with Benedict? She's too tall for him. Danny's out, but it's his 11. Don't touch the guy. Look at me. No good. You look down, they oh, know you're lying. Smooth. Don't shift your weight. Oh, boy. Look always at your mark. He's got to like you and then forget you. And for God's sake, don't under any circumstance. Russ. What? Don't what? He's going to do whatever it was. Don't under any circumstance. Oh, gosh. He's not feeling good. Time. I feel like he's about to have a heart attack. Let's do it. I do not have confidence suddenly anymore. I have no confidence in this mission. Oh no. The crowd of celebrities, the two best heavyweights. Zerga. It's Thursday. Very busy night for me. Are we on schedule? Wow. All right. By Mr. Walsh selling Mr. Ocean's in the West slots. He doesn't miss anything. It's gonna be tough to do this right in front of him. So Bloom, is that you? <gasps> Fucking you, oh, Tanner, no. from Saratoga. Mikhail Vladimir. Hey, oh, no. I have never enjoyed the touch of steel. Ah, oh, crap. This is not gonna go well. Further agree to take custody of said briefcase. I cannot actually allow you to accompany the briefcase. I just don't trust you. Mm -hmm. But they knew that, right? You will arrange for your briefcase to be stored while you watch on a security monitor. Look at this thing. Pinch. These guys just play all the roles. All right. Please be cool. Deep breaths. I don't know. You're natural. But don't screw up. Definitely not as smooth as Jason Bourne. He gets the panic. Right oh, God, his hand. Oh, boy. You'll be able to monitor your briefcase right from here. Linus, you're up. Got him. All right, done. I'm about a gaming commission. Will you accompany me to Pit 5, please? Okay. Maddie D, let's see what you got. <laughs> That's Magazine. so crazy. 30 minutes of breathing time starts. We got a countdown. This just came to our attention. It's got a record longer than mine. It's long. <laughs> You've been at the commission long? Yeah, about 18 months. You know how Lindley over there? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Not since he died last year. Sheldon Willis, Nevada Gaming Commission. Hey, okay. They they got Ramon off the floor. I want you I out of here. One moment. Don't say you came here for me. You're pulling a job. Oh, she knows. You won't win me. I just came to say goodbye. I don't know. I don't buy it. No kiss. Goodbye. Okay. You'd be good. Well, they have chemistry for sure. But that doesn't mean they can be together, though. But I am kind of rooting for, for Danny. Mr. Benedict would like to see you. I thought he might. Uh -huh. Should I call you Mr. Catton? Are you not? I'm afraid you've been employing an ex-convict. Damn cracker. <laughs> Excuse me? Black man can't earn a decent wage. Want me to smile at you? You might as well call it white jack. Just resent the implication that race has anything to do with this. Yeah, right. We at the NBC have always supported colored. I didn't. I didn't. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, sit down. Oh, he got something. You better talk to him. He's got. What do you get? What do you get? It's the folder with the codes. <gasps> I think he got it. Ooh. Hey, dude. I think I lost my card. Are you serious? Oh, you're you good actors for this. Hey, don't. He's already... I believe he's that stupid. Just tell me, where did this high rollers room to the uh, vault? To so, the hey, vault. No, Next time, just remember the car. Perfect. Perfect, boys. All right, so far so good. But now that I've said that, something's going to go wrong. There, there's your briefcase now, Mr. Zerga. That's my cue. All right, handsome. You're up. 
show this man off the premises. Crap! Oh, dear God. <laughs> oh, I, I forgot my pager. You know your way back? I do. Good. Nice. No cameras in this room. Ooh. Don't want anybody seeing what goes on in here. Yeah, that's no good. He's not coming, is he? Oh. We're gonna step outside now. But Clooney's beautiful face. Oh It's on top. Uh oh, uh oh. Are you alright, sir? He's having a heart attack or something? Not his beautiful face. Not until later. I forgot. <laughs> All right. How's your wife? Pregnant again. Not until later. What are they doing? Ugh. All right. Who's that guy? Uh -oh. West uh -oh. Just call a doctor. Going to video. We have a man down and he appears to be unconscious. Oh, oh was this according to plan? Okay, okay. All right. Oh! Okay. You really didn't think I was gonna sit this one out. He better be cool and not like screw them over. Fight, fight, fight. Heist, heist, heist. Someone oh my. call for a doctor? Not his best look. So cute. All right, so that was meant to happen. Saul was supposed to do that. Okay, good. Makes me feel better. Rusty, the whole argument. <laughs> Why'd you just tell me? Why, why'd you put me through all this? This was all according to plan. Come on, man. <laughs> these guys again. We've lost him. Oh my. All these <laughs> Oh my God, cool. What are we doing here? These things are gonna hold us, right? Should. Let's hope huh. so. Oh boy. We're set. Livingston, we're set. Hang on a minute, Chief. We're set. Let's go. Pinch it. That doesn't sound great. <laughs> yeah. That was close. Just chaos. Whoa. Everyone just went nuts. Yeah, go, go, go. Dude, 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 dude. Whoa. What is it? What is it? What is it? Okay, knock them out, whatever it was. $160 million behind this <laughs> I believe in you, boys. I'm I'm back on board. This is gonna work. I'm worried about his hand though. Ten cents is yours. No bad. <gasps> Put his hand. This. Gonna blow it. Pins and floor sensors now. Blind. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Let's do it. Blow that bolt. Uh -oh. Down from twenty. Do not blow the door. Ten. Maybe the pinch blew out his ear. Minus. Oh no! I knew that hand was gonna be a problem. Oh no! But that's good for Yen. But uh oh. Dude, dude, go, go, go. Did you check the batteries? Oh my god. You lose focus in this game for one second. Oh, I know. It's the batteries. <laughs> Our piano is clear. Nice, nice, nice. What the f you bet? They got held up. Sorry. Look at all that money. The sexiest thing I have ever seen. Rusty, you're up. All right, Rusty. Let's do it. Can I answer that? This isn't mine. May I have a word with Mr. Benedict? It's for you. What are they doing? Who the hell is this? The man who's robbing you. Uh oh. What the hell's going on in the vault? Why would they just tell him that? 
And then you're just gonna send a bunch of cops to the vault? You're watching your monitors. Why would they show him that? Your luck can change just that quickly. Find out how much money we have down there. 150 million dollars. Is she impressed by this heist? Cell phone in. I think she's even more pissed. Perhaps you should. It would be better if you weren't around. It's gonna cost him later. Congratulations. You're a dead man. May I ask how you expect to leave? You're gonna carry it out for us. What? Take a closer look at your monitor. You have a little over 160 million. We're only packing up about half that. The other half, booby trapped. Okay. You try and stop us, we'll blow both cash lines. Oh, I don't think that's according to plan. You can lose $80 million secretly or $160 million publicly. What's he gonna do? Make the call. 911 emergency response. Where's Danny? He requests that you go upstairs and watch TV. It's all right, Des. You have a deal. I promise. Three of your guards will pick up the bags. If they take more than 20 seconds, we'll blow the money in the bags and the money in the vault. He's in the casino. Of course I'm in the casino. Mini bar. This is so amusing. When I get word, my men will exit the building. You will get your vault back. Our team is here. I'm sure they anticipated this. They called him, so they must. I have complied with your every request. Now I have one of my own. Oh, this should be good. Run and hide, asshole. We're not gonna hand you over to the police. Wasn't even listening. Get everybody in position. I want my vault back. What? They had to anticipate all of this, so... I cargo's on. Cutting power now. Maybe this is what they wanted. I got Power now. Well, that's just chaos. Find that honey hook into my system. All right, so they have the money in here, and they're driving away to the airport. How are they gonna get out of it? Danny Ocean has a plan. I'm sure of it. We able to determine at this time how they entered or exited. They're just that good. Take your men out. Blue team, move it out! They would probably be smart of him to get out of there until they figure out if there's any more explosives, but he's pissed. Huh. Are they gonna blow it? Oh, sorry. Oops. Enough monkey business. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just a minute, Dick. There was no money in the bag. So I oh. filled with flyers, sir. <laughs> Over the vault too. Where's the money? Where's my stacks? Cue up the tape to the robbery. Does it say Bellagio on the vault floor? No, it doesn't. We had it installed on Tuesday. Oh. It was staged. Somebody made a duplicate. What happened to all that money? Make the call. 911 emergency response. Oh my god, that's too easy. <gasps> oh, oh my god. <laughs> I didn't suspect for a minute that they were the SWAT. Ocean, you got me. And you just let them right in and right out, just like they said. Oh my god. Anyway. This is Keller. There's one in there. Oh, oh, he is in there. Oh, so he can't even suspect that it's him. <gasps> Clooney has an alibi. Brilliant. How's the other fight going? Is he like, I know it was you. Do you have a hand in this? I have no idea what you're talking about. You're free to go. Turn to channel 88. Yeah, I am wondering if he's gonna if he's gonna win back test though. What happened, Benedict? You get robbed or something? Uh-uh. I'm gonna give you one last chance. What's he gonna do? I told you I could get your money back. Do you give up Tess? That was a yes. <sighs> Oh, shit. I know a guy. Anybody pulls any jobs, he knows about it. Okay. I'll find out who took your money. You know a guy. Mm. Well. Contact the police. I'm sure he's in violation of his parole. He is. So that's not good. But he got what he wanted. He's smart. Yes. He knows what happened. In your hotel, there's always someone watching. Sorry, Benedict. Boys, get your money. You earned it. Wait, wait.
Wait, that's my husband. Dean. Kiss him. Tess, I know what I was doing. I didn't. Kiss him. How long will you be? Well, three to six months. I For parole. Leaving her again, though. Don't fall in love with anyone else while he's in there. Best crew in the biz. We did it, boys. I'm just gonna walk off one by one into the night. Ooh, three to six months later. Epilogue. He has been eating in every scene, making me hungry. There he is. I hope you were the groom. Ted Nugent called. He wants your shirt back. Thirteen million, and you drive this. Blew it all on the suit. Stop. And picked <laughs> up your personal effects. I'm not sure these belong to me. Yay! You said that you sold this. You liar. Thief. Kiss, kiss. Yay! Entailed though. Heist, 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 heist. Okay, guys, well, that was Ocean Eleven, and I loved it. If you can't tell, I loved it. I loved it, loved it, loved it, loved it. Freaking heisting with hunky men. Yes, please. It was super fun, super cool. Really good heist, lots of fat stacks of cash. Uh, we had, you know, switcheroos happening and fake vaults and real vaults. And oh my God, I, I loved everything about it. I had such a good time watching it. Let me know if you guys want to see more Oceans movies. Oceans 12, I guess, is next. So they add someone. Oh, I hope it's Tess. <gasps> That'd be cool. I would watch that, but whoever it is, I'm sure it'll be good. MVP, it's so hard because there's such a huge cast. The whole crew was amazing and it sucks to pick just one. I love them all. So what I think I need to do is just give it to Danny Ocean. He's the leader of the crew, put this crew together. It's his heist, he ran the show, got the girl, got the kiss in the end. I'm giving the MVP to Danny Ocean. George Clooney, hunk of all hunks. Loki MVP, I'm giving to the music. It was awesome, very heisty, very cool and jazzy and so many instruments and I was literally dancing through the whole movie. It made me so happy and so excited and pumped for a heist. So the music in this movie was awesome and super fun. The music is the low key MVP. And the worst award, to be honest, I don't want to give the worst award to Benedict. That is a good villain name though, but I kind of feel bad for him. They, they really took him down hard and took his girl and took his money and they really screwed him. So I wonder if he'll be back in the next one in some villain capacity could be but in this one we really don't know why he's supposed to be such a bad guy so i don't really think i can give him the worst i feel kind of bad for him but still happy that danny and the crew got what they came for i'm on their team no one was the worst in this i loved everyone okay no one's the worst if you guys can think of a worst let me know down below who's your worst but i'm just too happy to give a worst award i freaking love a heist I love ice. It was just super fun. So, hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I had the super funnest heisty time. Hope you had a super fun time too. I will see you next time. Bye guys.